The local residents familiar with the abandoned building's history know it simply as the Murder Hotel. The infamous hotel was run by a mysterious family for several generations until close Unrelated news, the trivia murder party killer is still on the loose. And up next, danger. This is your wake-up call. Prepare to die. Welcome to Trivia Murder Party. Your room isn't ready yet, so let's play a game of life and death. Only one of you will survive. It's all pretty standard family vacation stuff. Okay, first question. What does the R stand for in USSR? Use your device to answer the question. And the correct answer is... Who got the question right? Aw, oh, crap. Let's try another one. How big is the eye of a blue whale? Who picked this? The rest of you, it's time. Welcome to room 113. Yay! I love using Cousin Aloysius' magic props! Pick a space inside the box to hide. When this was used in magic shows, there were safeguards inside to prevent injury, but don't worry, I took those out. It's time for the volunteers! Now, can you confirm that we've never met before? <laughs> Just kidding. A little magician banter. You get a sword. On your device, choose a row or a column to run your sword through. I've always hated magic, but I do love swords. Magic! I wonder if that'll grow back. We're not done with you yet. Okay, so don't freak out. But you're a ghost now. Keep playing and you just might steal someone else's life force and win the game. Let's keep moving. Which of these authors spent some time in prison? This. The rest of you who are still alive, come with me. Welcome to room 227. Donation time. You all get $500. Give some of that money to another player. The person who ends up with the most money will die. But if you give to someone and they have a thousand dollars or more, I will kill you instead. Begin. Time for Fiscal Revelations! Too rich for your blood! Ah! 
There's nothing more satisfying than carrying on your family's legacy of murdering people in hotels. It's also satisfying to wake up one minute before your alarm. Let's try another one. Which birds have nostrils on the tip of their beaks? This. I want to show you something. Let's do a spooky handwriting test. The ghost of my Aunt Mildred loves to write words on mirrors. Pay attention to her unique handwriting. Now, Aunt Mildred is going to write a different word. But so will everyone else. Draw a word on the mirror to camouflage Aunt Mildred's. Let the drawing begin! Pay attention to the words as they appear and try to spot my auntie. So many convincing words to choose from! Now, type the word that Aunt Mildred wrote or you die. <laughs> Would the real Aunt Mildred please stand up? Oh, um... That's a weird mistake. It's time for you to join my Aunt Mildred. <laughs> We're here. When one player is left alive, we'll go to the final round. Next question. In Norse mythology, what will happen during Ragnarok? Who picked this? Time for consequences. Let's play a dice game. Don't worry, this one's real straightforward. The player who rolls the highest will die. But we've got some help to make this more interesting. You have an extra die that you can give to whoever you- <laughs> Dice pile up. Classic. Time to roll. The player with the highest total dies. You're so good at rolling, you can roll into your own grave. Ah! Let's keep moving. What's a vole? This. I don't like seeing that. Let's try another one. Finish this movie title. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 2. Who picked this? Everyone again? You all need to be taught a lesson. Ah, a money pile. Go ahead and take as much money as you want. But take the most money or the least money and you'll be sorry. Have fun out there. I'm excited to see what everybody took. Uh-oh. The most greedy and least greedy must be punished. <laughs> 
Let's keep moving. What are Swedish fish called in Sweden? Who picked this? <laughs> Everyone is wrong. I want to show you something. I'm giving you all scratch tickets. What a quirky last minute gift. Scratch and find three dollar signs to live. And if you keep scratching, I'll give you cash for all the extra dollar signs you find. But if you scratch off even one skull, you die. Get to scratching. We know what a losing ticket means. Crap, I killed everybody? I guess I'll bring one of you back. See, having the most money is good for something. The time has come. You've made it so far, but can you escape? I'm going to give you a category. Contains peanuts. Tap each answer that fits the cap. Let's see the right answers. You advance one space for every correct answer. You're on your way to escaping. Ah, but it's not just you. If a ghost catches you, they'll steal your life force. Then they can try to escape and win the game. Here's everyone's next question. And ghosts get a third choice to help them catch up to you. Actors in Sharknado 1 through 5. Time is almost up. Next question Roman Emperors. behind you! Are you afraid of the dark? States of New England! You're better than I thought! Butterfly life cycle stages. Time is almost up. You cannot run that ghost forever. One term US presidents. Of a gimme. The tables have turned. Aesop's Fables. Another life force swap. Movies about time travel. Time is almost up. This will slow you down. If you want to break through that barrier, you'll need a perfect answer to this question. And that includes the third answer choice now, too. 